Yo, it's Plexity. Hey, what's up, guys? Yep, it's another Plex Talks, but you know I'm not gonna use this puny, puny looking phone that I have. It is time for you know Plex Talks, but not any Plex Talks. It's the first 2018 Plex Talks. Like, it's been a crazy, it's been a crazy year. Today, this video is gonna be about you know looking back at 2017. And now it's been for me, cause you know we need, we definitely need to recap on um, 2017, and it's gonna be a serious video. It's not gonna be any holly jolly, you know, mixy. Hey, it's flexing the all zombies, you know. But my English is gonna, my English is definitely gonna be crap. My English is definitely gonna be crap out here. Late too. I'm late freaking on this day. It's not even New Year's. I don't even know why I'm saying Happy New Year's, but it's a, it's a, it is still a New Year, so I'm still kind of on point. Still not late as usual. <laughs> It's 2018, and it's time to recap. So, 2017 has been not really a great year for me, to be honest. It's not really, ha not, it, well, it is a, well, it was a great year in a sense, but it was still not a great year at the same time. I know, I know. Like, come on, man, you're not even making any sense, dude. Come on, I know, come on. I know, come on. I know. But it's still, like, for me, for example, like, it has its ups and downs. So, basically, it's been a great year, but not so great. So, because it has its up and down, like a roller coaster. Because, you know, the YouTube channel, I'm, not, I'm going to be honest with you, is, it's been dead. Not because of y'all. Not because of y'all. It's definitely because of me, because I was not being re very consistent as I was, you know, 2016 Plexity. Because I, <laughs> I got versions, I got Super Saiyans up in here. But, um... Yeah, it's not. 2016 Plexity was pumping videos every single, you know, every single day. Like, even, even, um, dude did two videos. Sometimes two videos. I was pumping it out with an iron. I was pumping out videos constantly. I even had school. I had school and I was still pumping that many videos. I was still recording. I remember, like, the top video I recorded in one day was 24 videos. 20 four videos in one day like come on 24 <laughs> like that is mind blowing to be that work like a worth ethnic to record 24 videos like that's a that's two that's like two and a half weeks of break right there no three now three and a half three and a half weeks of break man but i was probably i was that i had a worth ethnic and right when 2017 began it crashed that I don't know what happened to me I felt like I felt that just no energy at all just it just crashed I lost myself that's why I made like videos of you know me losing myself like what's wrong what's going on with me like I was crushing it everything I was crashing man and I thought I thought that was um me losing motivation to do YouTube and I was, I, I was afraid because I didn't I didn't want that motivation to go. I've been doing YouTube for so long that I didn't want this motivation to go. Because, like, creating and posting videos is, like, my passion. I didn't want it to go because I, I didn't feel no energy. Not towards, like, you know, not towards only uh, YouTube, but everything else. Like, I didn't feel no energy at all. Like, it was crazy. And it forced me. It's like, it's like It was like a forcing point to go on to like procrastination mode because there was no energy at all and it's it was my blood I lost myself I was trying to find myself for so long it was crashing I was still trying to post videos but I was crashing and then everything like more things escalated to where you know my PC crashing out like it gave out it was it was been it was working hard I had that of oh, laptop for so long it was working hard but yo it finally cracked this year i mean la last year not this year oh so, thank god i don't have <laughs> this laptop this year but yeah it crashed last year and rest in peace rest in peace that was the whole it was bad because I, because it crashed i didn't have nothing to record with i couldn't record i, I could only record with a playstation because i had a playstation playstation had a recording system there and i had the flash drive so i was an alternative it was an alternative because even though my laptop was gone family still got computers so i had to post anything i had to try to post anything but they, they didn't have an editing software so i was screwed so basically i was only left with a phone because not only did my computer crash but my microphone like everything my headset like it crashed to the point where i couldn't like 
the phone was the only thing I had to record. The only thing that I had to record was the phone. Because the memberships, plus the memberships on the Xbox One and PlayStation, um, I needed those memberships to play online. And also, you know, both side, both Xbox and PlayStation, my game sharing crashed. I mean, not crashed, but I, people, they uh, stopped game share with me it's been a bad year it's been a knockdown of a year in the channel i couldn't be consistent because it had its ups and downs and ups and downs like and i know y'all was tired of that because i was tired of it myself i wanted to do something but you know no energy like it was it was bizarre but i f i feel now i feel as though that was an excuse because even though i had this i still had what i can do and i could have done what i could have done because I still has equipment left to you know pump out videos and right like right when I had right when I bought this mic you know this computer and this table and memberships like everything I, I finally got a job everything was falling into place the only thing was that I still felt you know I still felt no energy no passion even though when I had all these things around I still didn't have no energy, no passion at all, and that's when things start to really, well, it, cl it climbed back up a little bit, but it was still slow, I still didn't have that work that ethic that it did before, and that really, that really, that, that sucks, because I really wanted to do YouTube, but it just kept crashing and crashing down, but that's also an excuse, because I, you know, again, I still have what I have, and I still could have done what I can, but there's no, there's no buts, to be honest, because that's what really like my excuses failed well failed me i the thing the excuses that i created failed like it failed me technically if that makes sense now i do like you know i have a job and everything i work you know all these are paid and it's it's grateful because before i didn't have a job at all like thank you thank god that i have a job like that opportunity came for me to have a job and i was working every single day not stop to you know get this money out so I could go towards my goals I even bought foams like because you know how noisy you know youtubers get when they loud when something epic happens and you know the fan was to you know turn you down like a volume press like freaking turn you down with a remote so it was kind of hard for me to pick a you know pick a time to record because you know the fan was always here and for me five o'clock is when I am able to record because no one is here to like you know take naps and everything so i'm here to record but when six o'clock come that's when they start to come back but yeah definitely definitely a crashing point for the channel and for me as well because i crash as well within myself and the channel crash because i crashed and you know i'm deeply 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 sorry for that and now like now i want to create like creating is definitely the reason why i live it's to create because if I don't create anything, then like I feel like what's the point? You know, I want to give out a message, like, but what's the what's the point of you know not creating anything that you want, but listening to other people's creations? Like, you could I could create something too, but I I want to create. Creating is my passion, and I just want to put something out into the world because I feel like if I don't put anything out into the world, then now like because I found that passion, I'm just gonna pump out try to pump use my opportunities now that is that it's here to pump out videos trying to pump out videos and try to get this work ethic back that i lost i will try to get this work ethic back and try to be creative or anything that i do whether it be youtube music or anything i just want to be creative and put something out and like even to send a message out because you know spiritual messenger i want to send something out but yeah it's like i'm sorry to be for this to be like a negative video but i just want to I just want to be open with you guys, like, to be honest on just the real things that's been happening. Because I, I genuinely feel that I I messed up. I definitely messed up. I'm owning, owning up to my mistakes. I did mess up and I'm super, super sorry about that. And I'm definitely going to definitely gonna push myself even harder. Even though people tell me I do work hard, I want to push myself even harder to, you know, push out videos. I want to create. I want to get this tool. I want to... I want this to be I want this to be an awesome channel. I want this to be a great channel, but you can't have you can't have an awesome channel without the you know the creator pumping out the videos. But I do this I definitely do this like no subscribers. I don't care about the subscribers, I don't care about the views. Like I do this for y'all. I put I try to post videos, I try to do it 
do everything for y'all it's just now now i need to I definitely need to get a reality check and definitely need to start doing things and that's when 2018 will come when that experience starts to you know go on because i really definitely really want to start this youtube thing again but this time more stronger than ever but anyway sorry sorry to ramble on i don't want this video to be too long but yeah this is a message out for everybody do like if you have the opportunity to do something do it even if you don't when you don't feel like it or when you just have no energy you feel like you're dead inside just do it because like it's the best experience ever to put what you created out. Don't be a perfectionist because I've been a perfectionist. And it was being a perfectionist gives you writer's block, creative creativity within you because you think, oh, it's not perfect. And it's going to lead to self-doubt and like overthinking. Don't be a perfectionist. Accept good enough. Accept good enough and post anything that you can. Work on your skills and crafts, but don't be a perfectionist. Work on your skills and crafts, but just don't be a perfectionist. Do what you give out your all, but don't be a perfectionist, but work on your skills and crafts. Know your flaws and work on them and then just pop it out, but don't be a perfectionist. Because that's that's definitely a writer's block of creativity to me in my opinion but definitely be creative definitely put out what you want to put out definitely live how you want to live be yourself create yourself you can also find yourself but i think it's more better to create yourself if you're lost but anyway this is puck city if you like the video smash the like button to a million pieces this is puck city and i'm out deuces